Evening everyone, welcome to the Late Night Show with me, Tick. How's it going? Okay, so, it's been a bit of a poor week, really, um, for me. So, I think I'll just jump straight in. This might be a shorter show than usual, because of things. So, what have I been up to this week? Well, uh, I've been playing mostly on the Hypermine, uh, which is the modded server, uh, to, to give you an idea about how the branding of the the Hypermine stuff goes, it's the Hypermine is the overall name, and then we have the modded server and the uh, vanilla server, and the modded server is colloquially known as just Hypermine, and the vanilla server is uh, colloquially known as Hypercraft. And you can refer to them as Hypermine modded and Hypermine vanilla if you like, either way. There's no there's no strict branding in place. It's just these are the things that have grown up uh, around the servers. So uh, we had the new map come out for Hypermine uh, last week, which I talked about. And for the most part, I've actually been playing on there. Uh, but what has really been affecting me this week is that I've been quite ill. Uh, I got the flu last weekend, and I've I've done some some recording but for the most part I avoided recording I sounded terrible I just felt awful in general uh, I didn't go to work or anything even though I could work from home I did that on Friday when I was feeling a little bit better so it did affect my recording and I'm really sorry about that it's just um, the way it goes and I'm sort of in the recovery stages right now suppressing a cough as I speak uh, <laughs> so uh, there's there's not been really much going on this week this past week. Hypermind videos came out. Uh, I missed a Hypercraft video, and uh, this video is coming out a little bit earlier because obviously things are slightly different at the minute. There wasn't anything interesting really this week. I'm really sorry about that. I wish there was. However, we're going to have to make up for it in the week coming. So. Uh, what's happening next week? Well, we still have the usual uh, Hypercraft, Hypermine, and uh, Dead Space, and uh, Runes of the Minecrackers 2 with Albanackers. Uh, those are all going perfectly fine. Uh, what it is looking like at the minute is that I will be upping the number of Hypermine videos that I produce over the next week, because there's just so much to do. Uh, and because there's a lot to do, there's a lot of video I can fill, and if I'm not making video, I'm just sort of wandering around working on plans in my head because uh, there's a lot of stuff that I want to do on camera because it's interesting to show you things like um, laying out the land and stuff that stuff is getting done without without needing to show you that that's that's no no worries at all um, so I might be producing an extra two hypermind videos per week until we get to a point where I'm only doing very big projects and uh, then we'll slip back into the normal schedule, but we'll see how it goes. Depends on how I feel, if if my flu gets comes back and gets worse or whatever, or if I get much better. Hopefully, <laughs> I won't feel ill again. I hate feeling ill; it's the worst. Okay, so I haven't really been doing all that much over the past week. Um. I have, however, been watching a bunch of YouTube. I've been catching up on pretty much everybody that I watch. And I've also, this this week, been watching Confound It and Random Obsessor. They're my two new people to watch. Uh, Confound It is great. He does huge amounts of things. And he was recently running a competition as well uh, for, I think it's a piece of recording equipment. God, it escapes me right now, but uh, the guy's very much about giving back to the community that supports him, and things like that, and him and Random Obsessor have recently joined a server with Joe the Pirate, which is the Too Crafty server, uh, and videos have started to come out for that this week, which is great, I've been trying to catch up on, keep up on all of those. Um, they're playing in an amplified biome. And if you don't know what that is, an amplified biome is a generation option in Minecraft that produces uh, allows the generation scripts to use the entirety of the height map, so from 0 to 256. 
for generating terrain. So it produces these huge, huge mountain type things, and the land is all broken and messed up, and, and it looks awesome. Uh, particularly mesas and extreme hills, they look amazing. So you should really try and check that out. Try just load up uh, an amplified world and just see what it is. Uh, Random Obsessor's Obsessor is a uh, is just a new favorite of mine. Uh, her videos are always light and bubbly. She's giggly, but she gets stuff done, and um, it, it just her videos are a lot of fun to watch. I, I, at this point, I'm thinking to myself, have I spoken about D before? But maybe. But uh, yeah, so her her videos are a lot of fun. She recently left the block centric server. I don't know the story there, but it's not really our business. Uh, and so now she's joined the server with Joe the Pirate, uh, the Two Crafty server. So check out that. Search for Two Crafty. You'll find a lot of good videos. Uh, their welcome video is particularly hilarious, especially all the outtakes. Okay, so <laughs> wow, this I'm really rat rattling through it because I'm trying not to cough. <laughs> uh, what have I been playing this week? Um, well, because I've had so much more free time, I've actually gotten back into World of Warcraft, and uh, I am actually finding it a lot more fun again. I kind of stopped it because I I wasn't finding it as fun, and I really wanted to concentrate on my YouTube uh, stuff, but it's I'm much better about how I manage my time at the minute, so or now than I used to be. So I'm able to do both and uh, I'm not too concerned about the hardcore raiding and so forth because that used to be what I did. Uh, yeah, yeah, because I was at home meal loads of time. Um, but I don't, I'm not going to be doing raiding to that degree anymore. That would just, it's just silly. That's five days a week plus whatever extra time you need to get all your all your materials and make sure that you're you're perfectly up to date and ensuring that you're keeping up with how your class is meant to be played to 100% and it, there's a lot of work that goes into making sure that you can actually keep up with that sort of thing right cats cats talking to me whilst I'm recording because it's um i i've always taken a great deal of pride in making sure that I played as well as I could and that I was always bringing what I what, what I needed to in order to play perfectly because that's that's just how I was about it it's because you you your time it's not just your time that you're wasting if you don't play right you're wasting up to 24 other people's time so you know you you feel bad or well, you should feel bad <laughs> if you aren't, aren't aren't bothered about it and just roll along. Anyway, that's enough about Warcraft. <laughs> yes, a seven-year-old addiction that I just can't shake. Um, other than that, this week I've I got back into playing some more Mark of the Ninja, um, and X re X three Rebirth has just been done, uh, released, but unfortunately. I haven't got a copy of that just yet. I probably will get that at some point in the next few weeks or so. Uh, so I've been playing X2 uh, quite a lot in the last couple of days, just to, just because I love those games. They're they're big and uh, super involved, and there's just there's just always so much going on. And I I really do enjoy games that that require you to t take the time and know what is going on, learn its systems, and then use them to your advantage. Uh, it's part of why I enjoyed EVE. EVE, Eve is very much about uh, utilizing the systems that are available to you. Okay, uh, so what's coming up in the following week? Well, you'll have noticed that we didn't have a guest on this week. Uh, due to my illness, I wasn't able to... I, I didn't take the time uh, and effort required to set up a, a server that other people can join. Uh, and arrange for my first guest and possibly two guests. That was the deal for last week, so um, I'll be speaking to them and we'll we'll arrange something so that I can start to put guests down on the show because that's what I want. I want people to be on the show and 
talk about the things that they did in their week and what what they're looking forward to and so forth. Uh, other than that, yeah, a lot of things have been put on hold this week just because I've anything that required actual effort from me just hasn't been done. <laughs> I have taken the absolute lazy option the whole week because I've been ill, and I deserve it. Yes, because I'm worth it. <laughs> All right. Uh, I, yeah, there isn't really anything to tell you about really this week. It's it's just been it's just been me being ill and feeling sorry for myself, and that's about it. So I'm gonna call it here, and next week let's make it a really good week and push on and do what we can. So thanks for watching, everybody. You've been a fantastic audience as always, and I will see you next time. Adios.